Born on September 1, 1971 in New York, Rachel Zoe first made a name for herself as a celebrity stylist, but told Elle back in 2015, I thought I'd be a restaurant hostess for the rest of my life. You know what? Being cool is I'm so, so not about cool. being cool. I'm yeah. kind of a big fashion geek. That's I what I am. I'm fine with it. Instead, she became synonymous with Hollywood's biggest names and the online fashion blog The Zoe Report. But following her meteoric rise to fame in the early 2010s, sparked by her reality show The Rachel Zoe Project, Zoe has nearly disappeared from the limelight. Let's take a closer look at exactly what this fashionista's been up to. I'm really proud. Like, I have the most amazing team, and I think this is kind of where you see it come to life. Rise to fame. Zoe started out as an assistant at YM after graduating college. In just two years, she was promoted to senior fashion editor and then she, quote, decided I'd be better off leaving my job to freelance as a stylist. Working her YM industry connections, Zoe landed her big break telling Elle, I met Jennifer Garner's publicist and she hired me to style Jen for the Emmys at the last minute. This was my first big job working with an actress and her being seen in the glamorous look I selected changed everything for me. Fame in the 2008 premiere of The Rachel Zoe Project on Bravo would happen in the years that followed, but it wouldn't last forever. Must not see TV. And pose. Oh, you think it's good? It's out of control. Oh my gosh. Bananas. In 2013, Bravo announced that it would not renew the Rachel Zoe project. According to a source for Radar Online, viewers loved the drama of Rachel's staff, but after she fired two of her most popular employees, Brad Goreski and Taylor Jacobson, there wasn't enough drama left to save ratings. Zoe later returned to the small screen in 2015 with Lifetime's Fashionably Late with Rachel Zoe. It took me a while to get back on TV. I kind of had to wait for the right, the right thing, the right, the right time and everything, something that felt right. And this just feels so natural to me. Oat Mama. After tying the knot in 1996, Zoe and hubby Roger Berman welcomed their first son Skylar in 2011. Then in 2013, the pair had their second son Caius. Zoe immediately embraced motherhood, even canceling her New York Fashion Week show following Caius's birth. It's unfathomable love, you know, and I think like watching it. I mean, I think Roger and I both get very, very teared up. So gush to people, they're both equally amazing, just totally different and delicious. Skylar is me and Caius is my husband in every way. In 2017, the 45-year-old mom threw her boys the ultimate birthday party with 65 kids, 30 reptiles, and a 20-foot T-Rex. Making Herstory in March of 2017, Zoe found a new outlet, Instagram Stories. Harnessing the power of the Snapchat-like feature, Zoe now connects with her fans via two-minute videos shot by her husband, Roger. She has dubbed the project Real Life with Rachel Zoe, sharing new clips every Sunday and telling WWD, I think that given what social media has become in our universe, it's just totally natural. They want things that are quick, funny, fast, and not overproduced. High Tech Style in an April 2017 collaboration with Google, Zoe was tapped to create a dozen stylish phone cases, which retailed at 40 bucks a pop. The Rachel Zoe Live Case collection features designs inspired by her fall ready-to-wear collection. Once snapped onto the phone, the cases sync with the device, pulling up custom wallpapers that perfectly match the case. That's so amazing! Kids by Zoe Zoe teamed up with Paul Frank in April 2017 to release a stylish collection for kids. She told InStyle, They invited me to their fashion show in 2015 and I went with Skylar, my older son, and my husband, and we had so much fun. Zoe revealed, Since I was pregnant, everyone has asked me, when are you going to do kids? So when Paul Frank approached me about doing this collection, I was like, well, this is sort of the perfect way to get my feet wet and dive in and see what it's all about. A good cause. In 2017, Zoe signed on with Moms and Social Good, a United Nations Foundation and Johnson & Johnson initiative which aims to, quote, share ideas, inspire action, and tackle some of the world's most critical challenges facing the well-being of moms and their families around the world. Zoe was brought on board as an A-list speaker to help leverage the power of social media to connect these passionate experts, advocates, and parents with others around the world, making it a truly global event. Coachella Bella Zoe's Palm Springs event of the year, Zoasis, is, quote, arguably the most fashionable fate at Coachella. VIP guests, including style influencers, models, and it girls, are treated to what Magnetic Magazine calls a labyrinth of luxury. The grounds of the 2017 bash included everything from a gourmet coffee bar to a mini nail salon, an ice cream counter, DIY jewelry space, and, of course, plenty of cocktails and swag. Princess Dreams Despite having worked with some of the biggest celebs in the business, from Kate Hudson to Jennifer Lawrence, Zoe still has one dream client that she has yet to collaborate with. She revealed to Hello, I'm obsessed with the royals. I love Kate Middleton. I love her. She's amazing. I want to dress her. I feel like Kate wears a lot of lace and a lot of color and a lot of jewel tones and she's such a classic beauty. I would make her anything. A box of Zoe. Want $400 worth of Rachel Zoe lifestyle delivered right to your door? There's a box for that! Each quarterly box of style includes fashionista must-haves perfectly tailored to each season, all curated by Zoe & Co. Oh, hello, gorgeous.
gorgeous. <laughs> so cute. It just makes you feel better at that moment. So right away, you're happy when you open a box of style. First launched in March of 2015, the box delivers a mix of fashion, beauty, and lifestyle staples and treats. Spring 2017's box included goodies by Tatcha and Estella Artois Chalice in support of Water.org's efforts to provide safe drinking water for developing countries. Fabulous future. These days, Rachel Zoe may be going less public, but that doesn't mean she's slowing down. Juggling parenting along with running her own business, designing several fashion collections a year, and balancing an ongoing mix of fabulous side projects, it's safe to say this is one fashionista who never sleeps. It's the last minute finishing touches that make it that magical moment every single time. Thanks for watching. Click the list icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out this other cool stuff we know you'll love too.